Wilt Chamberlain's greatest highlights, the GOAT in his prime. Welcome back to the channel everyone, I'm Damo. I'm Nick. And this is a video that's been put together by a channel called Fubus Sports. The yeah. original, uh, the link to the original is in the description. So if you want to see anything else that this channel has put out, you'll be able to find the link um, in there to be able to do that. But yeah, yeah, Will Chamberlain, it's a name that has come up over and over and over <coughs> again, apparently statistically yeah. untouchable. And we just haven't managed to get around it to him. So we haven't, this, no. I've been told on good authority, this is the best Wilt Chamberlain video out there. Okay. I'm expecting at least one comment disagreeing <laughs> with me on that fact. There Absolutely. always is. But yeah, I cannot wait. I cannot wait to see this. So yeah, let's get into it. Thank Hope you. you enjoy. Ah, oh, Warriors. He thought, and rightfully so, that he was the greatest basketball player that ever lived. Physically, he was still the most imposing physical player that ever played this league, period. There's no one that's come close to him in terms of just physical prowess. And as athletic as any man who ever walked the earth, you try guarding that on a basketball court sometime. This was more than just some big guy who dunked the basketball and uh, mm -hmm. ran up and down the court. This was a true athlete. And his physical prowess was unbelievable. He's going to the basket. He's a big guy. Deep, there's Wilt to block the shot. Ooh. Boy, Wilt blocked that nicely. Wilt playing another tremendous game. Wrap around. Oh, no, the no, no, no. are here and by jumping in. Great That's play a great for the big man. Around. Great defensive work. Tremendous ball handling and a tremendous demonstration of speed and ability. And it's just hard for people to fathom what we talk about when we say what he did. Uh, he did things that I that just defy description. I, I can remember plays that he made that when I would talk about him, people said, no, he couldn't have done that. And I'm telling you, like, he was just a great, great basketball player. Here comes Boston. But Chamberlain keeps the pressure on. Will rebounds for a fast break. For the Eastern All-Stars, as Will Chamberlain comes up with another rebound. Will sort of toying with uh, the opposition. West leads by four, 85, 81. One thing I just want to say before I get too far into this is he looks massive. Exactly what I'm thinking. Against... I obviously it's the other basketball players. Yes, yeah, he looks huge. He looks right. absolutely huge. Right. I don't know how tall he was, but he's got to be what seven foot. Got to be a very athletic for a big man as well. Yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. built mate, built. Built is well. Chamberlain gets away, away from Bowman. Chamberlain again underneath. Great shot by Chamberlain. By the fact that he led the league in assists later on show he could pass the basketball. So Will, Will had all the tools. He didn't display them all the time because he was asked to do other things. He can hurt you with a fist like that also, playing the post. Oh, that was a great oh, pass by Will Chamberlain. Will Chamberlain, most valuable player in the National Basketball Association this year. You know, obviously, and his legend remains um, across the whole league. I'm glad he, the three-point line went around for him. <laughs> he would have figured that out probably too, so. <laughs> oh yeah, there's no three point line, yeah. I'm glad I played in this era. Let's put it that way. <laughs> Wilt Chamberlain. Oh, how wow. about that? Wilt still tries it. And in she goes. Chamberlain turns and shoots outside. Good. There's somebody going through the middle, nobody goes. Wilt takes it in himself. Puts it in there. Wilt did not go in and bump and dislodge people. That was not his game. And if you remember, the main point is 60% or more of Will shots came on fadeaways. Wow. Yeah, it, Chamberlain it does have is a great the greatest fadeaway scoring shot. machine the game That's has incredible. ever known. And he can score on you in dozens of ways. Here's one you can't stop, the fall away jumper. And he hits this repeatedly, despite good defense. That fall away jumper just cannot be stopped. Beautiful. When this giant walks out on the floor, the 76ers automatically have a great number of points. Unbelievable shot, Keith. If he gets that close to the basket, I don't see how anyone can stop him. I think yeah, it's so hard to stop. It's just, it's just so imposing. He just, he just that, that's the one thing about Will. Will did not like to lose. He always wanted to win. So if he'd have been 6'4", 6 6'5", 6 or 6'6", 6 6, I think he would have had the determination. He probably would have had more of that killer instinct also to dunk the ball and just... The amount of times he's hitting it off of the backboard. Yeah. You don't see a lot of that. 
I've not seen a lot of that no. in the highlights that we see of more recent plays. You just yeah. don't seem to see a lot of that. I'm guessing there's a reason for it. Um, the players don't do it anymore. Yeah, I'm not but, sure um, why, it would, why yeah. it would be. Destroy people. Because of his size, I think he really held back most of the time and didn't try to dominate with his physical body. And I thought, quite frankly, that he was more of a finesse player wow. than a power player. And yet, when he did turn on, on the power and exert Yeah, literally all his shots are banked off presence, the uh, backboard. He was unstoppable. Were you as great as you were because of the time, or would you be as great now? I mean, there, there's, you know, 15 seven-footers now. There were three in your ear. Well, I, I disagree with you there. I think it was a lot of big guys when I played. Guys who weighed more than I did, a few guys taller than I was, a lot of seven-footers. But today, the guys are much more athletic. But I think sometimes when you have all that going for you in the body, how is your head? I said, you know, Will, I think I'm the only guy on this planet that knows how really good you are. Because he was smart on top of everything else. He was the smartest guy I played against. The Celtics press the ball to keep it away from Chamberlain. He scores anyway. Chamberlain gets the ball, his double team puts it in nonetheless. Chamberlain boxed in and all, still gets the shot away. Chamberlain banks it in. Chamberlain outside. Chamberlain in the pivot. Wow! And to Chamberlain. Chamberlain scores! It's kind of Kevin Durant-ish. Like, well, yeah, look how tall he is. Of course, he just shoots over everybody. Puts it up, Wilt knocks yeah, it down. Awesome. Oh! Great shot by Chamberlain. Jones, three on two. Russell! Blocked by Chamberlain, a great Ooh, block by Chamberlain. That's a great block. That Bill Russell. Two great think. plays by Bill Chamberlain. Yeah. Now let's watch his defense. He's going to challenge Wilt. He does. Wilt flies, swats it right down his throat. Wow. Jumps it up over Wilt. Wilt blocks it. Ooh. That's four block shots for Chamberlain. Chamberlain blocked it. Great play by Chamberlain. Chamberlain gets the ball. Nice play. Trying to get it up over Chamberlain. He drives it down his throat. The heights and he's deep. Blocked by Chamberlain. He switches to Krebs. Blocks the shot. Sam Jones. Good block oh, by Chamberlain. That's a great block. It's a three inch height advantage. Chamberlain got just enough of it. Three inch height advantage. Blocked and Chamberlain has the rebound. Going to drive over Chamberlain. Will slaps it out of there. Good block by Chamberlain. <laughs> It's like having a goalkeeper. Oh, I know. It's, it's cheat code. It's, <laughs> it's cheat code like, for the time. Literally. Yeah, I, I knew he'd, when I saw how tall he was, I knew he'd be good uh, defensively because... Yeah, he, he yeah, no, he's always going to be awesome on defence. It's yeah. just amazing. I've not. There's so many things I'm seeing him do that I've not seen anybody else do. Yeah. The, off the backboard nearly every time is just... Yeah. I, I, if that's what all the players have been doing in all the videos we've seen, then <laughs> I don't know what I've been watching, but yeah, it's... Interesting to see his style of play. Yeah, definitely. Because I know the stats that accompany from previous comments are apparently ridiculous. Oh, okay. The stats are just incredible. Penetrates, gives to Jackson. Chamberlain blocks it. Put it up again. Chamberlain slaps it out. That's seven times Wilt's blocked shots tonight. Oh, yeah. 100 points in a game, I think. Oscar working, working. Oh, Chamberlain yeah, yeah. Good defensive play by Wilt. Barry puts it up. Over Chamberlain. Wilt slaps it out of there. Down the middle, Chamberlain flies. What's that out of bounds? He is awesome. Chamberlain blocks it. It's out of bounds. Oh, the call goes in. That's what he calls his finger roll, and that's a tough shot. You just don't block that shot. Ever boys never rush. Rolled off his fingers when he wants it. Wilt spins around his defender and 47 and 48. Into Wilt. Goes in and scores. Wilt working against and Russell goes over with a finger roll. That was such a hard shot. Yeah. Chamberlain puts it up and in. And it's for Will as he leaves wow. the game. And they're giving him a standing ovation in many sections of the arena. Earl Strong, the legendary referee who's no longer with us, said if we call all the fouls on Wilt, we wouldn't have a game. So there was two sets of rules <laughs> for Wilt when he played. Will Chamberlain driving on Russell, and you may see a lot of that now. Here's a little bit of a misconception. Yeah, it was Bill Russell. A lot of people think, yeah. hey, Wilt was scoring against everybody else, and he wasn't doing diddly against Russ. But there were games the Celtics might have won where you got 45 points, 28, 30 boards. I you think you had your 62 one night, I remember very clearly. 62 off you? Yeah. I won't ever forget that. Will, of course, is a great rebounder also. Uses his height and his weight of about 290 pounds. Such a unique shot, isn't it? Finger roll. Yeah. 
Chamberlain, rebound. Chamberlain for the rebound. Chamberlain rebounds it. Chamberlain the rebound. Chamberlain in the rebound, number 13. Chamberlain gets the rebound. And the 55 rebound game, how about that? To go against Bill Russell, the great defender, and get 55 rebound rebounds. Game. People say, well, he, he wouldn't do that today. <laughs> yeah, he did it against Bill Russell. I knew that this is what I was supposed to do if I really wanted to dominate uh, the game. It was the rebound. And it was something also very gratifying about it. When you go up there, you grab that ball and you squeeze it. Back to Russell. Off goes. Chamberlain snaps it up on the board. Rebounds it. Comes to Chamberlain. Reed guarding him. One of the greatest scores rebounders ever. Chamberlain worked hard. It's interesting what the announcer said there about the rebounding. Mm. Um, and someone said, yeah, but would he do that in today's game? Because I reckon that would be a lot of... If there are disagreements in the comments, I would imagine that will be it. Yeah. Uh, he played back then and the game's more competitive now. And... Whilst that may be true, what my argument to that would be, well, with sports science and everything else that's evolved, yeah. what's to say, Wilt, could he be an even bigger freak in today's game than he was back then? He yeah. didn't have any of that fitness knowledge and the sports science and the medicines behind everything. No. He could have elevated him to whole new realms that he didn't oh, even yeah. know he had. Yeah, if he played into that in the current, current game and... Yeah, like had all that, like you said, then he could definitely compete. But it's just really hard to compare two different yes. like time. People like to do it, and they normally would argue for their favourite player, but you just can't. Sometimes you have to just keep them separate. He's murder around the basket. Yeah, but it'd it's not enough crazy to hold back Boston. today's game. Phillips driving, blocked by Russell. Chamberlain with the rebound. The basket is good. Much, yeah. No. <laughs> Seasons with over 2,000 points. As the all-time high scorer of the league, Wilt sets records every time he plays. Rebound coming off and Chamberlain gets it. There's that great strength. Rebound, three ball, Chamberlain puts it in. First score for the East as Chamberlain backs up the play and taps it in. Get the arm. Chamberlain <laughs> has it. It's just unbelievable. Chamberlain with the rebound, put! Russell had his hand on the ball, but Chamberlain forced it through. Missing, forced the shot, Chamberlain! A remarkable shot on a fine defensive play. Shot is up and missed, but Chamberlain has the rebound. And he dunks it. I noticed you were shaking your head, Freddie Shouse, when Russell passed the shot, and Chamberlain forced it through. He's just so powerful, Marty. Slam dunk, Will Chamberlain! Chamberlain! Yeah. Following up again, as he has so many, many times in his great career. Wilt Chamberlain inside with a rebound. When Wilt gets it that close, pretty hard to handle it. Furious battling under the basket. Yeah, you can't stop him. And it's dunked in by Chamberlain. Go for now. Chamberlain on the left. Dominated the game for a long time. Wilt one to Chamberlain. Chamberlain. Oh. Into Chamberlain, he's deep. Oh, it's an inch out. Seven foot one. And Will Chamberlain on the dipper dunk. Will, Monster. he gets an easy one. Will Chamberlain dunks one for Philadelphia. Chamberlain, seven feet one, dumps one in. Inside the Chamberlain, he's got seven it. Feet one. Chamberlain Oscar Robinson bounce passes to Big Will Chamberlain, and it's a basket. Next there'll be Nicky Mudfield Chamberlain. Underneath. <laughs> he dunks it. He's got it now, and he bangs it in. Just conjecturing here, how many can he make? His first six years in the in the pros, Wilt Chamberlain averaged 42 points, 25 rebounds, three assists. Chamberlain got Best one. Pictures. Pass into Chamberlain. Whoa. Chamberlain. Stats surrounding him. Muscles his way under yeah. for a two-pointer. Slam dunk. All right, Wilt Chamberlain, surprise. Oh, that's, yeah. that's nice. But when you're that big... He's, he's on another level. Oh, hard. Beard. In an 80-game season, he played 79 complete games. He missed eight minutes of one game because it got thrown out. That's that nuts. was inconceivable, that is. Just one game, 48 minutes a game, is really enough to say, but uh, playing a whole season, 48 minutes a, a game. Forces his way in, fakes, now shovels one of the baseline to Chamberlain, and puts it up, and it is in. Live action as Chamberlain turns and goes to the basket. I mean, when I look back in retrospect, 
I said, what were they doing to me? Chamberlain with his back to his man, fires out, takes the back, lays it up, it is good. Beautiful move by Chamberlain. Jesus, it must have been some time when I could have gotten, gotten a rest. But unbelievably, <laughs> he never took one. Gives it to Chamberlain. Dropped it in and he's fouled. How the hell do you stay so strong all Put season? How do you avoid fouling out? How do you take a beating every night with guys pushing you, punching you, grabbing you, and come back the next night fresh as a daisy? Hmm. Yeah, that's crazy. You're only missing eight How minutes out of 80 this, games. Well, this is yeah. Chamberlain puts it in. I was paid to play basketball and people paid to come and see me. And so my coach and the owners felt like, hey, people pay to see him, leave him out there and let him see him. And I was able to deal to deal, deal with it in such a way that only missing seven minutes. And I look back on it now and go, hey, Hal, I, mean, I, I can't believe it myself. I would love to see him play against some of these centers today. It would, it, would, it would be pretty embarrassing for them to be candid with you. And even more astounding was the scoring. It's a record, of course. That's ridiculous. That I thought I thought he was a Laker at some point. I don't know who he played for. No, Joe. Well, I've got the page up. So let's have a quick gander because I think I saw. So I think yeah, he, played he was. He was. Was he seventy sixes? Yeah. So his career history. Yeah. Do you know what his first team were? Uh. Was it Warriors? Was nah, it? trick question. It was the Harlem Globetrotters. Harlem Globetrotters. <laughs> um, wow. Then he went from there to the San Francisco Warriors. Yep. They were the Philadelphia Warriors. Yep. Then he was at the Philadelphia 76ers for three years, and then he went five years to the LA Lakers. Nice. He was a two-time NBA champion, uh, 67 and 72. So one with the Sixers, 76ers, and one with the Lakers. Nice. I thought we would have won more than that, to be fair. But yeah. then I suppose wasn't that around when you had the Celtics winning just about everything. Around that time, yeah. yeah. <laughs> 50 points a game. That's right. 5-0. 50. The man's averaging 50 points a game. That's what he averaged over his career. <laughs> I think that's what they're saying, yeah. He's averaging 50. A bad night is 44. <laughs> we were in awe of what he was doing out there against the best players in the world. Rogers takes the jump shot. It's no good. Chamberlain puts it in. Good follow up again by Chamberlain. Tip. Chamberlain. Rogers missing. Rebound. He'd get 63. He'd get 70. I mean, miraculous things. Chamberlain slam dunk. Michael Jordan scored 50 or more points. 31 times in his career. Impressive. Wilt did it 45 times in one season. The biggest, strongest, yes. and the greatest score of all time. How do you stop the guy? There's only one way to do it. You know, Max? Drive the hook, lays off the cable, and stops it in. The big guy is turning it on tonight. I heard one team had what they thought was a perfect defense against you. They locked the dressing room door. <laughs> <laughs> Great video. Oh, brilliant video. Yeah, that is a sense. Really fun watch. I, I think I was just smiling the whole time. Yeah. Really, really great to watch. Um, big, big man. He was almost unguardable. And no wonder he had such great rebound stats. So he's a, he's a giant. Yeah, yeah. 7 1, that athletic back then as well. It was almost yeah. like he was ahead of his time. Oh, that, and massively. That's probably, I don't think I've watched another video where I have seen so many first timers. There was so yeah. much he did in there that's just completely unique. And. Yeah. Yeah, I just haven't seen that, that with that other finger players. that finger roll shot is so unique. Oh, I've never seen that. No, there were um, multiple. It's shot like um, Kareem's skyhook. Yes, shot. Like, the first time I saw that was when I, I watched still Kareem. can't it's, get that. It's ridiculous. It looks like the hardest shot in the world for me. I just well, any shot would be hard yeah. for me. But it, like, how do you roll it off your fingers and get yeah. enough speed trajectory to get it in the yeah I, I don't and know. get the accuracy yeah. behind it is crazy, crazy but no what a what a player and yeah I feel yeah. like that video was that video is brilliant yeah um, very good we said the creator in the intro but yeah if you haven't checked out their channel definitely would recommend it yeah that was that was excellent that was a fantastic video fantastic player it is such a shame that we can't compare if we find a way of doing that we'll definitely let you know first <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah let us know your thoughts below who you'd like to be say, seeing us take a look at next are there any other Chamberlain videos out there that you would like to see us taking a look at as well mm. we'll see you on the next one